started texting me asking me if I was on the train if I was close to the train station if I got down if all this random question and I asked her why what why are you so in a rush and she was like okay if you got down just come immediately because do you have the identity card and I was like obviously I have my identity card so she was like come immediately shut up and run to this place and checking out the position of this place i found out it was a travel agency and then it clicked because a week before uh, she told me that uh, she would have got her off days uh, during my week birthday so she had in mind to go somewhere but she didn't talk to me she was just Hinting here and there, she was looking for some offers, some budget traveling destinations, and so basically, she paid a week and a four days trip to Stockholm in Sweden. Wow. Oh my god, it was like total surprise! I didn't have in mind, I didn't know at all she had this in mind, and it was a special. Trip. Okay, I will stop talking now because seriously, we have to get going this video, it's super fun. Please subscribe to my channel, and leave a comment down below, I love reading your comments and leave a thumb up please. And so yeah, let's go. And here we are on day one. Day one was nothing special actually it was all about traveling because our plane was quite late at night so we did everything calmly we took a train we arrived to the airport and there we wait quite a long time before getting into our plane that took us all the way to Stockholm Kapstad airport and from there we booked in advance two seats in a bus service that took us all the way to Stockholm city center and from there we arrived to a beautiful hotel <laughs> so we just arrived at the hotel it's super good but oh wow this is so neat the hotel is so nice it's a small one but not too small so this is the entrance like then I think the bathroom is here oh look there look there <laughs> and this is the bedroom. The bed is so tall, it's tall as me. Oh, look at that. Ah, there's a huge TV, a table over here. And yeah, but this is the room. I don't know what's here. Okay, so nothing is here. <laughs> It's so tired, we are super tired, it's 1 o'clock, 1 past, 1 a.m. past and 
here. Yeah, it's the coat finally. And so now we will wash ourselves and then go to sleep. And tomorrow will be an awesome day. We have an extra bit of Stockholm. And yeah, let's see what this city has to offer. Good night. Bye bye. Ciao. Good morning. So we just had breakfast. It was amazing buffet. I had my Swedish meatballs. <laughs> so good. And now we are going to explore the city. We'll see what to do because we organized some things. Uh, we have a list of stuff to see. And let's see if we can cover it all. And I hope it doesn't rain. But even though this weekend they have put bad weather. And here we are outside of Delta. We decided to walk around the neighborhood because the night before when we arrived it was pitch black outside. So just like that, without notice, we arrived at the Stockholm city centre where we were welcomed just in front of the Royal Palace by the Royal Bath. After that, we wanted to get to a very famous place. We were looking for Stockholm, the oldest bar in Gamla the old town in central Stockholm, with its iconic colorful buildings. Little behind the scene, we got totally lost looking for it, and when we were about to rip each other's heads off, we found it, and the place was totally worth seeing because architecture is amazing, and nearby you can even find the Luther Museum. After exploring the little streets of the city centre, we arrived to the huge royal palace. Just in front of it, there's a port, and we got on a ferry that took us to our next destination. Free smoothies, <laughs> and now we are going to that's right, we went to the ABBA Museum. I mean, Sweden is home of the Abbas. Look at my mama. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that on this trip, one of her wildest teenage dreams came totally true. I 100% suggest you to go. You'll travel back in time. This place is not only for those that were born in the 60s, 70s or 80s. It's unbelievable how many people like me in their 20s were visiting this fun place. <laughs> The music of this legendary band is timeless and you can still hear it because it's still living on nowadays. singing and there was even karaoke you may ask me did i go no china's got the best of me and seriously i regret that so much because i just stood there listening to others singing so i want to tell you one thing 
If you want to try something new, if you really want something, just go for it. Don't block yourself just because you're scared. We got just one life and you have to live it to the full. So just go for it. Just like that, in a blink of an eye, our beautiful first day in Stockholm came to an end. We came out of the museum and till the last bite, we took pictures and we even stopped a local Swedish woman and asked her if she could take a picture of me and mom with my little Polaroid camera and she was so sweet that she agreed and she took that picture. Walk back to the harbor where we took our little boat that took us back to the mainland, and from there we went. We started walking back to our hotel, and before that, we stopped in a little uh, coffee shop. Yes, because coffee is priority. We tried a typical Swedish cake called the princess cake. It's my style kind of cake. It's it has cream. It has sponge cake. It was delicious, I loved it and with that and with a beautiful cup of matcha latte and my mom had a coffee, we ended our beautiful day. But it's not the end, stay tuned because more videos are coming and trust me the next one before we went back to the hotel, we I wanted, I actually requested this from my mom, we stopped to <laughs> to McDonald's. Yes, I have this rule. Uh, if we go to a foreign country outside of Italy, I, I need to try their like special, uh, unique McDonald's items. And so that's what we did. We went to McDonald's. And But I won't spoil anything because you have to stay tuned and look my next video because that's coming very soon. So with that, I will end this video. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe please, leave a message, leave a comment. I, I read everything and yeah, have a 